everyone. Just wanted to give everyone a quick update. <clears throat> it's been almost, I think, about a month since the last video, and I wanted to show you how big this red noodle bean plant or plants have gotten, and I've gotten several red noodle beans already. Let's see here. You see this? It's about a little bit more than a foot long. And um, it, I think I probably will let it grow just a little bit more. Um, not necessarily in length, but um, in, um, in width before I pluck it. So maybe, maybe possibly another week before I pick this one. Um, we'll see. I know the younger, the, the younger you pick them, the tender they, the more tender they are. But um, I'll see. I'm going to you know, try it out and see how much longer I'm willing to let it go. So that's one right, that's one on this one. I already picked off two off of, um, off of this plant right here, which is not doing too well. Um, it, I don't know what happened. I had gotten two, two beans from this one. You see we right here, one off of this one and then one off of this one. Um, they all, they both, two, usually two flowers will appear but both of these, um, only two, of, only one of off of each branch, um, set fruit and um, gave me a bean. But after those two beans, it just—I mean, like up top here, you know, as it vines up, um, I had actually just um, put the top off of here. But it, it had like it just—it wasn't growing for like a week. Nothing new. And you see how small these leaves are? They're still very small. Compared to these two plants in this five gallon pot, I mean, look how big they are, the leaves. And this thing is just gone up and up and up, and it's growing really high up. But this one has just been really stunted, and I'm not quite sure why. And I was just about to pluck it off, pluck it out. I was about to uproot it and just, and just, sorry for the noise. I was going to uproot this because it wasn't really growing. At least I didn't, you know, I didn't see any new growth. And the leaves are just still the same size. They're still so small. But then um, I was, I kind of actually did pull it out. And then I thought I noticed it looked like there's some new growth, like right around here. So I decided, uh, you know, let me just put it back in. I put it, put it back in this pot and um, I'm going to give it another possibly another week or so and if still nothing changes with this I'm gonna uproot it and just um, put a new plant I'll put I'll put another bean um, seed in here and actually I do need to plant some more seeds because I definitely I don't think these two or three plants will um, produce enough because the thing is this is sometimes it's like I get the two beans but two beans is not enough to cook with so I want to be able to get enough at a time where I can actually make a meal out of it. But um, just wanted to show you in here, oh, the, um, they, the flowers, they already closed. They open in the morning and then they, they you know, let me go around this side. They open in the morning and, and then they close. They, they, they open for just a little bit and then they close in just a few hours and then the next day or maybe later in the afternoon or usually the next day I'll see um, the flowers have fallen off and usually usually you will see oops sorry and usually you'll see this next day see these these two have they each had a flower and here are the little baby beans and they will get big and they'll they'll turn red as they continue to grow and if you see there's another one right there um, and so and here, here are some more flowers that will probably open tomorrow those two one of them is bigger than the other you'll see them they'll open up tomorrow so and um, so there will be more flowers right there there should be some more flowers and um, so these are doing really well. 
So I just wanted to show you really quick what's going on with my red noodle beans. And I'll see you next time. Oh, and one more thing. I just um, I wanted to show you that I um, put a basil plant in here. I was looking for some things to plant with the beans. I'm not growing any tomatoes right now. And um, I read that basils are good with beans. So, and I actually needed to separate them from the pot that they're in. Because there was like five pots. I mean, sorry. There were five plants in the one pot. See, there was five of them in this pot. So they were kind of like, they kind of like weren't growing as big. And then too, a funny thing is that I've been noticing something's been eating the leaves on this one. And um, so you see these chew marks, something's been eating basil, my basil. And I was looking at them and I find, I find them stink bugs on them. So I've been picking them off my basil. And also um, I took two of them out of here, or I think I, I, think I took three of them out of here. Cause actually there, I think there were six plants in here. So um, this is a very small pot, so they needed to be uh, thinned out. And so I took the two, I took them out, a few that I had out and I, um, put them in here or I put one in here anyway and um, two of them I put in, put in, another, in another pot and so I just wanted to show you that uh, also point that out that I have that growing here with the uh, with the beans and we'll see how how it does in this pot with it alrighty then so have a great day and I'll see you on the next video bye bye